Good morning, everybody. How's it? How's it going? Right. Hello, I'm Paul Magnet Manula Hat, as you can see above. Next change, still the same person. Uh, right. We're in. We're in Lee again. Believe it or not, we're on the Bridgewater Canal again. Uh, we're at a place called Mather Lane, Mather Lane Bridge. Behind me, as you can see, is a huge structure, an old cotton mill. That is massive, been all converted into flats and stuff like that, but it's uh, got a like, nice little bridge over there we've got. But I'm gonna give all a, a little throw in here. Uh, some of the team in here already, Alistair's here, uh, as you know. Welch Dragon Magnets, he's already here. Right, so, first three chucks, let's get it over and done with. Uh, we'll see what we can get out in the first three goals. Marvellous. Right, so, so, I always say it, Evolution Extreme, 1800 kilo magnet, 360 degrees, the Evolution. As you have, people might have know, past couple of videos, I've got a massive chunk out of it there as you can see but it still works still doing its job uh, i have been in contact with uh, miles from online magnets hello miles you all right mate and he has said as soon as the next batch comes in he's going to give me a shout so this will be getting replaced soon with a brand new evolution extreme 1800k magnet so but it's still, it's still doing its job though so i can't they run with it just want to Nice shiny brand new one. Anyway, first three live chucks, buckets are out, let's go. Forgot to say, the last time we came here, uh, I only had the beast, the 500 clamp was the last time I came here. Now that must have been well over two years ago, maybe longer, two and a half years. Because from the Beast, I got the Drag Queen, the 700 double-sided uh, clamp, and then I decided to get... It's gonna start raining. It's raining, isn't it? Oh! I'm gonna put my coat on, won't be a minute. Ta-da! Coat on, right, anyway, so as I was saying, the last time we came here, I only used the small, the small magnets, so we was hitting a few things from what I remember over here. So who knows with the bigger magnets now we might be able to start getting all of the, the heavy stuff. That's if nobody else has been here. But anyway, let's get on with it. Cheeky thing there, it's uh, part of an old fencing, by the look of it, old railing. Uh, oh, nice, that's some weight in that. Couple of nuts, uh, a caliper off a push bike, lots of rusty bits. Something heavy over there. Yeah. Don't know what that was. Not sure what it was, it's come off, but it was heavy. Right then, uh, well, <laughs> I've got one of them tape, them tape applicators that you put the, the big masking tape on, boxes, yeah, caution, sharp knife, there you go, one of them, uh, loads and loads of bolts, couple of batteries, batteries there, 
yeah, loads of little bits of metal, really old metal as well. I've got here. Don't know what all these are. Little things on them. Just some writing, but you can't. It's it's unreadable. Oh, it's unreadable by me. <laughs> Part of a Christmas tree. Oh, Christmas tree, oh, Christmas tree. How lucky are your branches? <laughs> and a 10 pence piece. Boom. Little 10 pence piece on the side. Yep, let's get the little money bag out. Well, we'll put that. Put the 10 pence pieces and the 5 pence pieces in the money bag. All the ones and twos, what are always rusty as hell. You can go somewhere else. Joanne's my banker. She's going to keep hold of all the money. Surprise, surprise. What woman doesn't want all flaming money? There you go. You can't grab it. Oh, you have to set that water out the back now. It. Sorry. Last jug. Oh, I've got a little bit of history here. Oh, I like that. I'm not going to get that off. Oh my god. That's oh. <laughs> That's solid. Oh yes. Wow, not a clue. Don't know what it is, that's solid metal. Sign. It's not. It's a sign but uh, what do you have a sign up You think so? I'd have gone for a weight off a of great grandfather's clock. Oh, right, so metal bar, little loop at the end all the way through that is solid metal that big clunk there god knows what that is not a clue alistair thinks it's some kind of weight uh, but what a long weight yeah that's that full weight some some uh, some weight in that i like that but yeah don't know what it is it's like got a a brassy goldeny colour on the outside edge of the, the weight system. Oh, oh yes. I felt that clunk on, I felt that clunk on that straight away. So uh, like I say, in that wrong with magnet, even though there's a big chunk out of it. There's Molly, do you wanna say hello Molly? You say hello? If you can't just stand next to the camera, then waltz off and not say hello. Say hi everybody in YouTube land. Hi everybody in YouTube. There we go. Oh. Molly from Welsh Dragon Magnets, Marvel. The magnet's full of little bolts like that. Absolutely rammed of them. Probably the best part of about 30, 30 of them on the magnet. Don't know, but some kind of gear system. It's got all cogs on one side there. Weird that, whatever that is. Not a clue. Some old contraption, whatever it is. See the, the cogs there on that side? Wow, don't know what that's from. Not a clue. Ah, how good's that? A really old one kilo weight. A little one kilo. Oh, wow. It might not even be one kilo. It could be in pounds, that, to be honest with you. Could say in pounds, the, the actual weight of it. I'm going to give that a brush up in a minute. I've got a little brush for that. Turn it around where? Yeah, there's some money on it. Is there some money on it? No. <laughs> is there some money on it? Oh yeah. This is gonna be 
An interesting place, I think, today. Wow. I'll give that a clean up in a sec with a brush and I'll see if it's got uh, any marks on it. Part of a... I don't know what that is. It's off something. Anyway. A grinding wheel. Uh, it's for raking out the mortar on the buildings. That one there, it's called a raking. Uh, you put it in your grinder and it just takes out all the mortar in between the bricks before you repoint it. That's what that is. And again, absolutely loads and loads of nail, uh, of uh, bolts, little tiny bolts, loads of them. Lovely. So it must be a really old one because this weight, I've just been able to clean it up a tiny bit more. Uh, it's a seven pound, seven LB on it. Seven pound weight. Everything's in kilos nowadays. So this is some, it's some age to that. Seven pound, love it. Nice little find that, superb. Bye. No worries, mate. Another one of them posts, again. Uh, it's old fencing, where the bars used to run between them. Uh, another one, lovely. Oh, we'll be laughing if we get a lot of these today. That's my second one today. Then. Another small square section pole. Scaffold clamp. Some electrical cable thing with a little thing on the end with a thing. I don't know what that is. Not a clue. Oh, it could be an old bike lock. Yeah, it is. It's an old. It's an old push bike lock. Again, lots of these little these little triangular things with the holes in the corners. See the little holes there. Little square holes as well. They yeah. are. So, not sure what they are. That's big circular uh, pipe connector, spacer, something, another, don't know. Rain's coming down again. All right. I found another, wait, see this thing here. So you can imagine that being held up by a bar with another bar going across and then the basket at the other end and it used to weigh what the amount of stuff that was in each back of the basket old scales that's how it used to slide in through the the bar and then sit on it like that wow that's my second decent weight today that i've had love it you can see them are not really really old a pair of scissors look at that wow they're corroded to hell then they've been in there a long time only small fingers, so maybe it's for a child. Who knows? Because they're only very, very delicate and small, aren't they? Wow. First blade of the day, a little bread knife. Little blade. Oh, look how thin it is. It's that thin you can, you can bend it. It's got nothing in that. But another one. Another one. Those weights. Again. It's got the uh, the piece missing out the centre. Or is it? Oh no, sorry. Sorry. Anything exciting? Nothing yet, mate. No, nothing quite exciting. It's an old cog, as you can see all the way around there. It's it's got all the little Teeth. little wrinkles. They're not from factory. Could have been. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, it could have been. Yeah. Cotton yeah. Mill. That's what we're looking for. Yeah, that's where it were. Cotton mill. That oldest yeah. it will. That with the concrete floor. Yeah. Was it? Yeah, I did my hand here on the sixth floor. Sort of. All right. Anyway, nice cog system there. Yeah. Lovely. Lovely. Again, there's a wall behind us. You see wall there behind us. Some bloke just went past on a push bike. Thought I was talking to him. Alright. Morning mate, you're okay? Yeah, Oh, it is a little bit damp. Really old spotlight. An old spotlight out of a building. But again, could be from could be from the mill, who knows? But yeah, a spotlight cover. Lovely. 
a very broken push chair. Mainly made of plastic, there was only a couple of little bits on that that were, uh, were, that were metal. Right, so we've just had this uh, find. Do you know what it is? I've not a clue. There's a clue there. What's that? Do you know, I have seen something like this before and I can't think what it is. Is it a jewellery box? No, you put your pound coin in there. No way. And that there goes to your television, so you can watch your television. It's not. It's coin operated television. How mad's that? Um, I have opened it. Oh, have you? No, it's in it, obviously. No. Oh, it opens up like that. And I only remember the old boxes that you used to turn and you used to be able to put a spoon in. You just don't look at that. All right. Your TV plug goes there. Yeah. Oh electric. yeah, your electric. Yeah. And then you pull that out. All the coins in there. How mad's that? Love it. What's it yeah. called? The what? Home. Home buy. Home buy. Home buy box. I love it. Wow. So How mental is that? So a landlord would have had that, wouldn't it? Yeah, yeah. It's a, yeah, yeah. Watch the electric. Yeah, watch the TV. <laughs> love it. Alistair finding all decent stuff again. Not on. I guess it's a shopping trolley. I've got a tally on shopping trolleys as well, and I so that is going to be shopping trolley number. Oh, I think it's number two or number three. But anyway, it's in that corner. My shopping trolley tally. Marvellous. And a couple of bars has come up with it as well. That's nice. It's fairly clean as well. That doesn't look as though it's been in there that long. That. Find out where it's from. See if we can get it sent back. Well, just. I've just moved that uh, shopping trolley a tiny bit and I've just found the smallest spinner I've ever ever had. Get off, flaming fishing line. Get out of it. Wow, it's absolutely dinky. It's, it's, it's that small, I'm gonna have to take my glove off to show you. Can't even grab it with my gloves. It's absolutely minute. Little tiny, tiny spinner. Wow, I mean that's small. Uh, made in. Oh, where's my glasses? No. They're not. I've got. Do you know what? I think I've got some in my pocket somewhere. Here I have. I'll have a look in a minute. But little, ti little, it's the tiniest spinners. Wow, love it. Yeah. Uh, just like to say uh, hello to Dan, the S Magnet Fishing. I've been here. And hello, hello oh, to oh, Neil oh. as well. Uh, as he were walking past. You're here for a surprise. I've just lifted my magnet out of the water. Is it another, is it another rubber fish? Oh, oh, look at that. Big machete. He's sniffed it. He's, he's on his way. Have a look at that cheeky monkey. Serrated edge along the edge there. Oh, ho, 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 ho. tell me what, Dan, do you want, should we, should we have this as our thumbnail for this week's uh, Love it, love it. And it's got a metal handle as well. A metal handle. So I'm not sure why it's got a metal handle. Ooh, nice. Alice has come over as well now to see it. <laughs> beat you, Molly. I beat you this time, and I. That's a bicycle stunt peg. That's a nice, that ain't it? Oh, is it? Oh, it is, isn't it? Oh, oh yes. So, it looks like somebody's put a bicycle stunt peg on the end where the handle belongs to. So it's a homemade chopper. dodgy chopper. A chopper. Had one the other week, and had another one now. Uh, the top of a chimney off a barge. Barge topper, chimney topper. I've uh, just pulled out part of the old gutter. The building above, the building above, the building, the building behind me got plastic guttering on now but this would have been the original shape and size of the gutters that it would have had coming down all cast iron <coughs> big piece of sheet metal don't know what it was off god yeah big looks, like, looks about four milli thick four to five millimeters thick whatever it is so Magnet stuck on the far banking. I had to get my winch out, and uh, this is what it is. 
a huge section of pipe as you can see there but I had to clamp me my winch back to this flaming post here that was the only way I could get that out but it wasn't moving it was solid so anyway Neil come over and Dan come over and we both all three of us got on it and got it out but look how thick that section is there look at that wow lovely cracking uh, cracking it'll find that won't it super some weight in that flipping it not sure what this is i think it's some kind of hold on big blob of water on my screen right not sure what this is but it looks like a big right wheel Not sure what it is. It's it's got a an hole through it, and then there's holes all the way round it, as if it was. Do you think that's what it is? Press wheel. Yeah. Oh yeah, and you pulled them round. Really? Right. So Neil thinks it's it's off a press of some kind. It's gold sprayed. A uh, solid piece of metal. That. My God. Absolutely solid. But yeah, it's, it's off a, a lathe or some kind where a press where you, it had bars all the way around it, what you pull round, and then the, the counterweighted pull, pulled it round, and that was going through the middle uh, of another bar. So, another cracking piece that, another cracking piece. It's a nice uh, scaffolding uh, bolt tightener that's got the little podger in that they, they stick in when they're uh, locating stuff. Lovely, it's nice. I don't, I don't think it's going to work again like it's, it, I don't know, it, it might be able to get released with a bit of WD-40 on it, but uh, there's something on there, I've not got a clue what it says. No, not a clue. Another one of those weights, with a slip over the top of that big weight that I had earlier on. There's another one, keep getting them out, lovely. All foods. You lock thing for a push bike. Oh, it's still raining, by the way. Found the old chair, of some kind. An old office chair, maybe. Years gone by. It's absolutely tated, tated. That is three legs, one leg missing. I'll try and hold this up, but it's making me nervous. One, two, three. Uh, right, it's a big, big, bleeding up. A big cast wheel, uh, probably off a, an old, uh, I don't know, like a buggy or something, or something they transported all the cotton out the mill around with. But, oh my God, that's, uh, it's got some weight to it. <laughs> Again, far side, that is. I'm getting everything right over there. I moved, by the way, from there to here. I've only moved about four, four meters, five meters, come across a bit. Everybody else is, uh, I don't know where they are. The vans are still here, but I don't know where they all are. Not a clue what this is, seriously. Not a, not a clue. Again, really heavy piece of metal, some really big industrial stuff, whatever it was for. Not a clue. No, well, it's like a tightener that tightens something up inside there, and that gap something slides through. I mean, it's seriously heavy machinery, whatever it was for. Another wheel again, this one's got all holes in. Wow, from the other side again. Uh, I'm really not sure what this is, but it's got two little handles on each side. One from each side there. Uh, it's some kind of... Hold on. Right. It's some kind of drawer of something. I'm not sure what it is. It's off some, some drawer or something. Uh, quite heavy as well. So it's really old. It's not like made out of uh, cheap stuff. But yeah, it's got a little handle at each side. 
big box thing, God knows what it's for. Another one of them weights again, they're getting bigger. These weights now, look at that one. That's a belter. I keep saying it's a belter, they're all belters. They weigh some, got some weight coming out today. Got a, some Velcro weights that you strap around your legs when you're doing your exercises. Like that. Lovely. There's, uh, there's like little metal filings on the inside, so that's why uh, that's why the magnet picked that up then. That's what that is, you just strap it to your leg and you do your exercises. Somebody's Christmas tree lights. Somebody's tried to make a, a grappling hook of some kind. The rope on the end of it there. No good with just the one little spike on, but yeah, looks like somebody's had a go at making one. Nice big old spanner. Don't know what that was used for, not a clue. Another really old cassette player. Look at that one. One's used to push the buttons in there to change the stations. And it's got a little cassette player in the side there as well. Oh yes, it's an old one. Any ideas? Because I've not got a clue. What that is? Not a clue. Some pipe thing for something, another. I don't know. The single wheel that I had earlier on, I've now got two of them. Two of the cheeky monkeys stuck together on a bar. So I don't know what they're for. I'll tell you what, it is. I can't believe the amount of old stuff we find in here. It's great. Again, more heavy, heavy, heavy stuff. God, I've not got a clue what this is. Not a clue. But, whew, that's it's solid. Absolutely, you should, you should see the struggle I've got me getting my magnets off here. Pure solid steel, that. Wow. Some big pieces still left in this canal. Right then, that's it. We've had another cracking day here today in Lee. Uh, on the manor, manor where? Manor Lane, Manor Lane. Hold on a minute. There we go. Right, yeah, Manor Lane. Cracking day today. Oh, we've had some really good heavy stuff out as well. Neil's had some amazing stuff. You probably you won't even see that unless Dan puts it on his video. DS magnet fishing. Also, Alistair, Welsh Dragon magnets. He's had another cracking find as well. Right then, looks like we might be coming back here again because believe it or not, where, where I am here, it's it's rammed. There's loads of really heavy, heavy stuff, all from this old mill as well, by the look of it. Anyway, I'd just like to say thank you very much for watching. As normal, I do appreciate it, I really do. Uh, don't forget, like, subscribe, and uh, share it as well, if you don't mind. Right then, thanks for watching. Take it easy, marvellous.